There are so many amazing artists in this region that um, we don't actually have to ever go outside of this region because we have so many great artists. We do want to have a global conversation, um, but I also want to highlight artists that I think are really unique to this region. And both Dohi Lee and the Genie, I think, represent, you know, in their own different ways, a very unique sensibility for what they do. Uh, I'm a performer known as Genie. I'm from San Francisco, and I created a style called scratch guitar, which is uh, involves live looping. Um, it's uh, guitar playing um, with um, so a keyboard as well as I have a iPod touch velcro to my guitar and from that I trigger beat. Dohi is a ritualist by nature and um, in a performer um, who is just extraordinary and world-class. Hi, my name is Tohi Lee and um, I am a performance artist and live in Oakland. I wanted to match them together because I thought that each of them could, um, could learn from each other. Um, I didn't know Dohi Lee at the time that Isabel proposed the idea, but um, uh, you know, we've, sub we've since then we've met and uh, talked a bit. I researched it here and there and then a few weeks ago I went to his uh, concert in Oakland. So that was the, ah, I can see him, I can see what he's doing it. And at the moment I was like, my brain was like, shh, like trying to figure out what I really can collaborate with him. For the show is uh, her being a singer I'll um, be the, in the same manner that I um, essentially sample myself playing live with the uh, loop pedals. I'm going to be sampling her singing live. I'm very looking forward, you know, really how much we can structure or bring some ideas and then beyond that how we can open to let it happen. I've been able to participate and share with all the genres basically. It could be a hip hop night or a reggae night, or an electronic music show, or, or just like a house concert. To me, it's like improvisation is really like, depends on who you are playing with. Because the moment you are playing, and at that moment, and the feeling, and energy, and the stories, and all those things really just transform to something new. Sort of take a risk as a curator to say, Maybe this will work, you know, I'll take this and I'll take this <laughs> and put it together and see what happens. And it may not work, but you take that risk and, um, and I th hope that they're enjoying themselves because, um, and I'm really excited to see what, what they come up with. Yo, I was born in a season, I was born in a season, I was, I was born in a season where the world was quiet. One of the reasons I wanted DJ Ladies is because I think that um, she is so, much in tune with the culture in San Francisco Bay Area. My name is Lady, DJ Lady. Um, everybody call me Lady. I mean, my whole name is Ladies Belfrede, but I think it's easy to call me Lady. And it's not Lady like Ladies, L-E-Y-D-I-S. Um, but yes, I'm from Cuba. I live here in the Bay Area. I have been here like seven years now. I love the Bay Area. She knows what um, people are listening to. I describe myself like a DJ world music. I really like experiment all kind of music. I really like music. I can, I mean, I play like how I would love to be. I mean, if I go into the club, I want to listen to everything that's good. And that's how I describe myself. I I have like a lot of music from Colombia, from Costa Rica, Panama, and that's just, I love when I went to this, you know, this part was with, where it's a lot of Latin people, because I can play that music and people really appreciate that. I really like how she blends the African American with the Afro Latino genres. That's just, I mean, I have a lot of dreams, but that's just one of my dreams, like to make a bridge between the Bay Area and Cuba and 
I can say we almost there. When we open the doors, DJ Lady's on, you know, she's going to be playing her music. And so from the, what I want is from the moment people walk in that they're just experiencing music and she's going to be keeping that vibe going.